Hello there! In this video, I'm going to show you the new notific planning notifications feature that we have avail available in Microsoft Teams. So here I am in a planner plan in Microsoft Teams. And first thing I'm going to do is just to assign a task to some of the users I have in this team. So let's imagine we are working on the new edition of the Office 365 for IT Pros, and I'm just going to assign a task that is related to uh, this. Uh, this work. So let's imagine that uh, we are going to design the list of topics to cover in the SharePoint Online chapter. List of topics to cover in the SPO chapter. We can set a due date, for instance, tomorrow, and then we can assign people. I'm going to assign Dave, and I'm going to assign myself. Here you go, and then I'm going to click on a task. Since I am the user that actually assigned the task, I'm not going to receive any notification. This is actually by design. So uh, when a user is creating a task in panel and is assigning, assigning the, the task to himself, herself, he's, he or she is not going to receive this notification. But let's see what happens in the case of Dave. If I go to another browser session, as you can see here, uh, I have a notification in two parts in Microsoft Teams, in the activity feed and in the chat. So let's go first to the activity feed. As you can see here, I'm having different notifications that are coming to from Planner. Actually, they are coming from the Planner bot. Uh, that, yeah, you can see here that, yes, this is an app that uh, is specifically designed to this uh, set of tasks. That's not the important thing. The important thing here is that I also have a private chat with the, this Planner application or this Planner bot where I can see in this very nice card that uh, I had been assigned to different tasks on different planners. In this particular case, all, this, all those tasks are related to the same planner plan. It's not a problem. And uh, in any case, what I can do is just to mark the message as unread. I can do, of course, the I like this message, or the thing I can do is just to open the, the task. We can click on open the task, sorry for the Spanish, some kind of weird thing because actually, as you can see, the user interface is full, uh, full in English. And as you can see here, uh, I'm redirected to the planner plan in the uh, in the Office 365 for the Pros team. And uh, I'm prompted with the task uh, that uh, I had been assigned to. So I can say, for instance, okay, we are working on it. So the task is on, on progress. We can set a label such as a, a test review, something like that. Of course, we can uh, add items to a checklist and so on. And once we are done, yeah, this is automatically saved. So we can close here and then we can move uh, ahead so we can check again the task. And the other thing is that uh, also we are going to see this task on the panel application itself in Teams. So here I am with the panel application. And as you can see here in the activity, uh, in the activity tab, I have the different tasks I have been assigned to. And of course, I can go to my tasks and I will see also the tasks I have been assigned to. And that's all. I hope you have found uh, useful this very nice feature that allows me basically to uh, get notified every time I'm assigned to a panel task in a panel task in, a panel task in Microsoft Planner inside Teams. So instead of uh, just receiving an email, I'm going to receive this very nice notification. So uh, as I say, I hope you have found this video interesting and talk to you soon. Bye bye.